it, it, was, it was rough to watch. You, know, like, I, you feel for the guy because you know everybody's looking at you. It's the biggest play in the game at that point. It's just it's, it's such a costly error. I, of course, I, I, you know, human nature. I feel bad for him. How weird is that sensation? I mean, it's your opponent, but you're also relating on you. Oh, it, oh, absolutely. It, I mean, for yourself and your teammates, you're extremely excited because it's, it's like a 60 yard play that basically a pass down the field that we got the ball. And, but at the same time, yeah, you watch him, you know, he's holding his head, running to the sideline, coaches looking at him, fans screaming at him, you know. It's one of those things that's a, uh, uh, it's an unfortunate situation. One team's going to be extremely excited about it, and the other's going to be, you know, down in the dump. So that's just the way it goes. I know on the kickoff, I mean, you weren't out there, but how difficult is it to, you know, to see that ball and try and well, feel in, that, in especially the, in that third quarter? In the third quarter, it was brutal because the, the rain was so thick, and, and when you, uh, with the uh, water blown in your face. It was, it was a mess. It really was. Third quarter was awful, and uh, and luckily it passed pretty quickly. But yeah, it, that that could change the game. And as you notice, I don't know if it, I think we might have thrown two like total two passes in the entire third quarter. Everybody was just running the ball because it's there's no there, there's nothing to gain throwing the ball in that kind of wind and rain because you, only bad things can really happen. You can you know an interception whatever. That's why we're all running the ball and trying to especially us being ahead. We were trying to control uh, you know t clock management. We we're trying to run out the clock as quickly as possible. And it was